Thank you. Try that. About 100 vendors set up booths at this year's holiday gift show. We have a waiting list of 13 that really wanted to cut in and I couldn't fit them in this year. So we're doing some things to recalculate and maybe adding more booths next year. So that's exciting. Gift show chairman Gina Bergman says she received feedback from vendors that sold so many items on Saturday that they had to go back and restock their booths for Sunday. Susie's Unique Boutique has participated in this gift show for 14 years. Todd Shackelford says he noticed an increase in business this year. This year it seems the crowds are really uh, incredible and they're not only here looking, they're buying as well. Everyone of course wants to come to these shows because you're buying locally. I think a lot of people are also looking to buy something unique for gift giving as well. He says the gift show provides a special venue for the business and its customers. It's just a really good way to meet your customers, to discuss with your customers what they want and, and to talk about your product with them. It's a great interaction with them. Proceeds from this year's show benefit nonprofit organizations throughout Quincy. The Quincy Service League also provides scholarships for traditional and non-traditional college students.